are millennials any different to any other generation? Um, we hear it, we see it, everybody talks about how millennials are completely different to every other generation uh, and uh, there's given rise to consultants and experts and all this kind of stuff in millennials. So are they any different? The data says that the actual human beings are no different. There is no difference between a millennial and a Gen Xer. Uh, the only difference that uh, is between them are external factors. So let me illustrate. Um, I am kind of halfway between. Um, I'm a Gen Xer, but I'm borderline in the sense of I could just squeeze, depending on your definition, I could squeeze just into a millennial if you had the broadest definition that's out there. Um, I grew up in my teenage years with no technology because it didn't exist. There was no internet, there was no um, mobile phones uh, in kind of common ownership that everybody had it. Um, but people born in the 1990s will have grown up with internet and phones. So that has an effect in the sense of people's access to information, uh, people's way they communicate. So the external factors has changed that generation as opposed to, you know, a 20 something this this uh, right now and a 20 something 10 years ago are completely different in the sense of technology, how the technology has changed the way we behave. It hasn't changed how we think and how we feel and how we respond to things. It's just changed how we interact with things. Um, and it's dangerous to compare a youthful generation with an older generation because, let me give you an example, the generation who um, are in the 50s today and the generation who were in the 50s 15 years ago or 20 years ago, if you compared them, they would be different, not by how they are, but by the external factors like technology, like economics, like um, all of those external factors. So some of the reasons there's a lot of resentment within millennials at the moment to uh, organise structures and corporations and things like that and um, capitalism um, is a result of that generation coming through one of the worst financial crises, crises of our time. If we were to analyse the people coming out of the 1930s, uh, financial crisis, we would find a, a lot of similarities. So I don't buy it, and the data doesn't buy that this millennial generation is any different to any other generation in the sense of human nature is human nature. It's people responding to the circumstances they've been in. So, you know, high student debt, economics, very difficult to afford a house these days compared to other generations. Um, these are all economic factors that have played into a generation, that have made that genera generation's issues more evident. But if you look back into the 60s, you look back into the 1930s, you will find these same characteristics within different generations. You will see exactly the same elements. The only variation is the technology. And the technology has just allowed you to access things and information more easily. So uh, it's a quite unpopular to say this, but the data bears out that if you look at uh, similar generations, uh, similar age groups across different generations, i.e. you look at the millennials, you look at um, a generation, the same, same age group in the 1920s, the 1940s, the 1960s is really interesting because 1960s, again, was a very free-spirited generation that, that grew up in that time. So you see this all the time. So the people are no different. Our triggers, our motivations, our wants, our needs, our emotions are not very different. It's the external factors, the economics, the technology that's making it different. And, you know, if you if you analyse now uh, a 55 uh, year old man with a 55 year old man from 30 years ago, you will find um, they're probably very similar, albeit they're um, their use of technology and the economics would be very, very different. So uh, are millennials any different than any other generation? The human beings are not, but how they uh, work out their life is a little bit different because of the economics, the technology, 
and you know all the factors of a modernized world but to target them to understand them uh, if you understand people and spend a bit of time at understanding people they're no different than any other generation